We're going to work on the abs, the external obliques, the uh, lower back muscles. So, uh, okay, let's begin. We'll start with a nice little warm up. Just take the legs as comfortably wide apart as you can. Feel that first point of resistance and stay there. If you want to elevate the hips, you can. So, sit on a cushion or a block. But make sure that that spine is nice and long and straight. And we're going to be working from the core here, twisting side to side. So, we're going to inhale center. Exhale, take the right hand towards that right left big toe. Inhale, center. Exhale, left hand towards the right big toe. Try and keep that core engaged so you feel like that twisting movement really being controlled from the core. Remember we're inhaling center and exhaling stretching. You should feel a nice heat starting to build in the core area now. Just a few more rounds. Keep connected with that core. Keep feeling that the movement's really coming from your center. Last few. Last two. You just notice how much more you can stretch than you could at the beginning. Okay, lovely. Let's interlace the fingers. Inhale, reach up, lengthen, stretch. Exhale, take that left hand down, reach up with the right, just take it over. Nice little side stretch. Take that right hand down, inhale, reach up, left. Exhale, lovely. We're going to come into a fluid bridge pose now. So take the feet hip distance apart, come all the way down onto your mat. Place the hands, palms down by the buttocks and really press that lower back into the mat. Then we're going to inhale, lift the hips and exhale, take the hands overhead. Inhale, take the hands up, and then exhale, take them down. So inhale, lift up, exhale, hands down. Inhale, fingertips to the sky, exhale, coming down. Inhale, hips up, exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, fingertips to the sky, Exhale, coming down. A few more rounds. Inhale, hips up. Exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, point the fingers. Exhale, take it down. Press that lower back into the mat. Inhale, hips up. Exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, fingertips to the sky. Exhale, take it down. You should start to feel this now in the lower back, buttocks, thighs. Inhale, lift the hips. Exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, fingers point to the sky. Exhale, take it down. Last two. Inhale, lift the hips. Exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, fingers point to the sky. Exhale, take it down. Last one. Inhale, lift the hips. Exhale, hands overhead. Inhale, fingers point to the sky. Exhale, melt down. Really actively press that lower back into the mat. Maybe draw the knees in. 
take a little rock from side to side. We're going to come into full bridge pose now. Place those feet back down, inhale, lift the hips. If you can, and if it feels good for you, interlace those fingers and draw the shoulder blades down. Option to stay here or step that right foot into the midline. Inhale, lift that left foot, taking the sole of the foot to the ceiling. Then exhale, draw that left knee in line with the right. Then inhale, lift it back up. Exhale, take it down. Three. Flowing now. Four. Keep that chest up. Five. Hold it here for one, two, three. Exhale. Extend it straight out. Holding one, two, three. And gently release. Inhale. Exhale. Take a gentle rock from side to side. We'll do the same thing on the opposite side now. Place the feet flat. Inhale, lift the hips. Interlace the fingertips. Draw the shoulders down. Take that left foot into the midline. And inhale, reach that right foot up. Exhale, draw the right knee in line with the left. Inhaling up two. Exhale. Inhale, three. Exhale. Inhale, four. Exhale. Inhale, five. Exhale. Inhale, take that foot up, holding one, two, three. Exhale, extend, holding one, two, three, and release. Well done. Inhale, draw those knees into the chest. And exhale, just gently rock from side to side. It's really important to strengthen the lower back as it supports us all day, helps prevent a lot of lower back issues when we strengthen those muscles. We're going to do a little working side plank pose now. So coming up, we'll come onto all fours. Inhale here. And then exhale, we're going to come over onto the right hip and the right hand. Feet are together. Hips and ankles are in line, knees are bent. Press down actively through that right hand. Take the left hand to the left hip. Then inhale, lift up one. Exhale down. Inhale two. Exhale down. Three. Four. Hold it here for one, two, three, four, five, and release. Well done. Let's do the same thing on the second side. This is great for really sculpting and toning the weights. Let's come back onto all fours. Inhale here. And then exhale, rolling over on to that left hip. Press down through the left hand. Ankles and hips are in line. Knees are bent. Right hand to right hip, inhaling up one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Hold one, two, three, four. Five and release. Let's come back onto all fours. Pop those feet up this time so we're in full plank. Now you can either repeat what we've just done or let's take that further. Inhale and exhale, rolling over onto the side of the right foot and onto the right hand. There's always the option to take that left, left foot behind you. Left hand to left hip. Inhale, exhale, take it down. Inhale, lift it up. One. Two, three, four, and five. Holding one, two, three, four, five. 
come back into plank, opposite side, inhale, exhale, rolling over onto the side of the left foot, right foot on top, right hand on the right hip. Remember your option, you can always take that right foot behind you. One, two, three, four, five. Holding here for one, two, three, four, and five. Well done. Let's just take a breath. Inhale and exhale. Okay, this is our last one. I'm going to work the abs now. So we're going to pretend we're rowing a boat. So take the hands into fists, bring them up in line with the shoulders. So we're going to inhale, exhale, take it forward. Inhale, draw it back. Just feel that resistance. Exhale, punch it forward. Inhale, take it back. If you want to work harder on that inhale, lift the feet, then exhale, take it down. So we're inhaling up, exhaling down. Inhaling up, pausing, exhaling down. Few more. Last one. Hold. Extend the arms now. And release. Come into a comfortable seated position. Ah, it's really important when we work on our core strength to work on the entire core, not just the abdominals. So this whole torso is really nice and strong and can really support us in all our other asanas. Let's turn the palms up. Let's take a few breaths together. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Inhale through the nose. Exhale through the mouth. Last one, inhale through the nose, exhale through the mouth, keep the eyes closed, palms turned up, relax the shoulders, round the hips, soften the eyes, relax the tongue, well done. Have a great day. Namaste.